the topic of problems continues. So today we're going to talk about why my new bra doesn't fit. How many times have you bought something that maybe you tried on at the store or you tried on with your fit stylist and it fit perfect and all of a sudden that new one came and it doesn't fit? Or perhaps, you know, you, you're the fit stylist and you know that that bra actually fit her perfect when you saw it on her and then she calls you and says, hey, Sally, this bra does not fit. I can't breathe. It's too tight. It's not working. So let's go through why that possibly is happening. Okay, so now what? What do we do? Your bra doesn't fit, but most likely it probably does. You know, have you received that call that our bra doesn't fit? I could tell you a little story about one of our fit stylists out in Northern California. She had a customer and she had met her, lived about an hour away from where she was at. Lady called her and says, this bra doesn't fit. It's so uncomfortable. I can't breathe. This woman, who fit stylist who really cares about her customers, drove all the way over to get to her to see why the bra wasn't fitting. It was just simple. She forgot to adjust the strap. So before you get in the car and you drive to go see your client or, you know, you, you take that call, let's go through the steps of what possibly could have happened. So you know what? I had forgotten how a new bra fits until I just recently got a brand new one from one of my factories, sent me a sample to try on. And I quick put it on, went out the door, and I'm like, oh my gosh, this, this is so uncomfortable. Granted, I probably didn't take the time what I normally do. So usually, typically what I do is I put my bra on, I bend over, I adjust my breast tissue with the opposite of my hands, doing all that, I pull it back up, and I, you know, click, you know, hook it in the back. And then I'm off for the day and I don't ever think about my bra again. But I've been doing it for so long. And especially if you haven't gotten a new bra in a while, you don't know what it feels like when it comes right off the, you know, factory line and stuff like that. So let's take a look at what this could be doing. So I want you to know that, you know, um, this is so important in sharing this with your clients is the steps to put on a bra correctly to talk to them through it as you're fitting them in the bra. Say I adjusted the straps. Say I put you on the first hook. Tell them these things so that when they get the bra, they kind of remember, okay? Or sometimes they don't. But I want you to do this. I want you to go take a brand new bra that you take one of your samples or take a brand new bra. I want you to walk yourself through what your customer is experiencing, okay? So put on that new Abby, that new Emma, or whatever it is. Take the bra straight out of the packaging. Just put the bra on. Don't do anything. Don't adjust your breast tissue. Don't strap, do anything to the straps. And then I want you to look in the mirror and see what the customer sees and feels. It does take time to put on a bra. It takes, if you put it on correctly, the bra will fit, okay? So let's go through. This is the, this is the, what she is not doing. She's just literally taking it out of the packaging and putting it on. She's not putting it over her breast tissue and making sure the underwire is underneath the breast tissue. She's not bending down and letting the breast tissue fall into place. She's not hooking the, the, the straps. She could be doing a hook and twist kind of maneuver. Um... She might not be adjusting the straps and doing what we call scoop and swoop, okay? She's not doing those things. Those are the things that we know that the customer should be doing. So this is where it's so important to teach all of your customers how to put on a bra correctly, okay? Step one, bend down slightly, drop your breast into the cups, and then come up and clasp the bra. Brand new bras should be clasped on the loosest hook because it, it does, the bra does stretch over time, but I always recommend in the fitting process, always fit it on the middle hook so that you know that it really does fit. But just do it on the loosest hook because the bra will stretch over time, okay? And you can always clasp tighter. Step two, scoop and swoop the breast tissue right into the cup, using the opposite hand into the breast, fiddle around with your breast tissue and get it into the cup nice and secure. Step three, now you can adjust the straps. And I always recommend taking the strap off the shoulder before you adjust because they have a lock in place kind of slide. So you'll be really breaking some nails if you don't. So slide it off, either let the hook, I mean, let the strap down if you need more room in the cup or tighten it if you need to have a smaller size. 
you know, most people don't know that the straps are what adjust the cup size. It has a huge part in it. The straps are not there to hold the breast tissue up. They're there to adjust with the cup size, okay? Step four, don't give up on that new bra until we, you followed all those simple steps. Get into it properly, adjust your breast tissue. Breast tissue is malleable. So move it around, adjust it till it fits into the cups. Make sure the underwires are positioned underneath your breast crease. So just right underneath that breast tissue, not pulling it down onto your rib cage. Don't do that. It goes right underneath the breast tissue. Lean forward, help those girls get in there, tightening or letting out the straps as needed. Straighten out the cups and give you that coverage, okay? Now, if that all doesn't work and, they, and you still feel like it's too snug, too tight, I'm going to recommend an extender because like I said, the bra does give over time. So a simple pop in the mail extender can really save the bra and you can get back to looking in the mirror and reward yourself with that uplifted bust line that gives you that little thinner and taller looking silhouette. Hopefully that answers your questions on why your new bra doesn't fit.